Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. You know what I haven't showed you yet? Look at this on the map. If you go to stage 8 from the map like this, select it, you fly to Vanera! It has a little mini cutscene off on the map there that I didn't show before. But anyway, 8-4 Mash Tooth's Last Stand. This is the big one, folks. Get ready. This is probably going to be a long part. I hope the emulator holds up. <laughs> I guess we'll see as we go. Look at this guy. This is a trapper. Let's attack it. Ah! We're back to the start. Yeah, they don't hurt you, but they're the annoying kind of enemy like wall masters are in Zelda games and that they transport you back to the start of the level. Thankfully, they're pretty easy to avoid in most cases because they're slow and they just track you and if you know how to lead enemies that track you down along, you won't have all that many issues. Basically, just make wide circles around them. Got it? Good. Anyway, we gotta explore. We've gotta find stuff. We've gotta not get digested. <laughs> Actually, no, they couldn't. Oh, jeez! They don't digest you, they transport you to another area and I've got to watch myself a little better by, go by going slower because when moving up there's not all that much screen room to really see where you're going and what you're running into. Uh, by the way, you can get a whole load of them in one spot like that and then just like treat them as one enemy. See how that works? That's another way to deal with enemies that track you in games. Uh, anyway, there's the door. Oh, I somehow missed the door. Oh, this is a neat area. Not so neat that there's bunnies here. Oh, poor bunnies. Well, I mean, bunnies are neat. What I mean is very, very weak, frail bunnies and, <clears throat> excuse me, mucus. That's a rock punk, by the way. They do that little spiky thing and they aren't really all that threatening. <laughs> Just don't hit them when they're doing that spiky thing. And that's a pajama. It's a lot like those um, bunny enemies back at the Sogwood Forest, you know, the ones that shot hearts out of their ears. Anyway, most sniffers going off. There's a chest in the area. We've got to find said chest. Where could said chest be, you wonder? Actually, I'm not sure. Could it be down this way? Yes, it is down this way. <laughs> a part of Moe's diary. What's the matter? I can't reach Starley for some reason. There's no communication with Puff Top Castle at all. I hope everything's all right. Seems like there's some interference with my transmission. Uncool. Well, actually, that's kind of cool because he won't be able to call Starly, <laughs> and then he won't ask me to call Starly. Yes, yes, yes. That's making lemonade. I can't make lemonade out of you, though. All right, moving on. <laughs> Don't worry. I will save you all. I will. Oh, jeez. Why did I jump into you? That was the worst possible reaction I could have done. <laughs> I'm probably going to do that a lot, lot, aren't I? Yeah, you just got to go under them like that, and there's no, no real issue. Uh, you could jump over it as it goes lower, but it's, it's much easier to just run, o uh, run under them like that. Oh, jeez. Take them on, Bunston. Come on, you carrot brains. Get up. We have to get out of here somehow. Soldier, what's going on here? My prince, what are you doing here? I, 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 am I seeing things? No, I'm here to help save you. I know you were alive all this time, Prince Bunston. But we are all... Mashtooth has stolen the power from all of us. And roughed us up greatly. Go, 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 go. These guys are not tough. How, how could you have so many issues with them? <laughs> Starfy, you're a cute... Oh, you are the cure for the common bad guy. And he is cute too. I just said cute instead of cure, but that is true. He's cute too. <laughs> it's Bunston. We have to get you out of here. Mash Tooth is just ahead. No, I, I left once my people needed me. That was how this whole mess got started. I won't make that mistake again. Prince Bunston, you can't. Out of my way, soldier. That's an order. I've got to help Bonero before it's too late. Starfy, let's go. All right. And the door opens. Hopefully there won't be more bunnies that are down like that. It's so sad to see bunnies like that. This this game has a really... I mean, it gets really dark near the end of it here. <laughs> it's, it's sort of like how um, Kirby games turn, not their cutesy 
uh, most of the time, but has great action, as you know, just like this. But uh, when it gets near the end, we get some really dark stuff going on. <laughs> yeah, anyway. <laughs> hey. Oh, they can't even move. They can't get down from up there. Don't worry. We will save you, cute thingies. You will have bunny parties one day. Ah! <laughs> You will have bunny parties again one day, I assure you. Okay, go over there, thank you. Uh, and I'll, I'm gonna lead him down there, so I have enough time to get up here safely enough. Oh boy. Okay, I'm gonna lead you here, good, good. Just, whenever you're gonna change direction, try and get them as close to you as possible. Oh, that was a weird sound effect. Emulator thing, obviously. Alright, what is up here? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, yeah, you gotta time yourself with these arrows if you want to get shot out in the direction. It's like a barrel cannon in uh, Donkey Kong Country. Oh, wow! Can you seriously, oops, chain these things like infinitely? Like, if you can do that, that this would probably be the. Oops, I should have went in the top one. This would probably be the uh, best place to get pearls in the entire game. Like if I hurry. Oh, it does work! Oh my god. Look at that! If you practice that and do it consistently, you can just keep getting five uh, I mean a whole load of five pearls each run. Wow! That is sensational! Look at that! Oh, I screwed it up. <laughs> But yeah, I, I think I found the best, I should say, I think I figured out the best pearl grinding spot in the game. But if I'm going to do that sort of stuff, I'm going to do it off camera. Whoa. Whoa. You feel that energy? Well, first we've got a treasure chest and a secret, secret door in this area. No. But do you feel that? Oh boy. Oh boy. Something's oh my! But first, go over here. Fly as far, I should say, glide as far as you can off to the left side, and here's the door. Let's do the door first. The treasure chest is below that, and off to the left, if I recall correctly. Whoa, Mo! Starfy, wait! A Benarian soldier is trapped up there. What should we do? Uh, no time right now. We gotta face Mash Tooth. Hey, now that's all we. You know what? You're right. We should. We should go rescue him. There are some Benarian soldiers who couldn't get away. They're up there. What should we do? Let's help them. All right, Star. That's thinking like a prince. All right, let's do this. Oh God, no! Oh, it's really slow. <laughs> oh, and it's. Ah. I failed. <laughs> Oh, there's no time limit. What am I thinking that it... That, uh, why did I rush there? There's no time limit. I'll try again. No problem, let's do it. Yes, I shall. Stick your shell? I don't have a shell! Alright, so... I'm gonna lead you off to the side here, because you're extra slow. Unlimited time to do this. Even slowing down the... Oof. Even slowing down the music, but it's not... It's not slowing down the game, though. It's another emulation thing, I'm sure. Hope this doesn't happen in the uh, final battle, because the final battle music is rocking. Anyway, oh, I was a little too jumpy there. I got ahead of myself. Oh, there we go! I saved you! Woo! Why do you keep going back in the ground? Everyone safe? Good. Hey, Star, check this out. The soldier gave me his map. Secret 3 has been added to the map! Yeah! All secret levels are unlocked. Uh, got anything else to say before I move on? There are some Banarian soldiers who couldn't get away. They're up there. What should we do? No, 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 no. No, <laughs> no matter what, there will always be soldiers up there, so let's just save them all in bulk by taking on... Mash Tooth himself. Anyway, let's glide down here and try and feel out where the treasure chest is. It's somewhere in the air here. I think if I recall correctly... Yep, yeah, there it is. It was on the left side. Mash Tooth Mask! Yeah, there we go. Now you've got 
the full Mashtooth Ensemble. Oh yeah! And when you make combos like that, um, a, a specials will appear like so. And oops, did not mean to do that. I want to go back to the top here. Go to a special here and go mash tooth the pirates. Yarrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
I feel some some energy inside you. What is the power that you hold in that tiny little body? That's right, Mashtooth. In all your scheming, you forgot one really important thing. Never. I have forgotten nothing. Well, I don't remember forgetting anything. <laughs> That's the point! There's something stronger than anything else in the whole universe. Something that you don't know anything about. Something you could never have. I am Mashtooth. I can have anything I want. What is it? Tell me now! Oh, don't you worry. You're about to find out. Let's show Mashtooth what we're made of and show him what he'll never be able to steal. The power of friends! Because friendship is magic! <laughs> I had to make that reference. Anyway, now the real battle has begun. And basically, it's a lot like Wrong at first, you know, in his attack pattern and whatnot. And that, oh, don't attack him when he's doing that. <laughs> when he's all fired up like that and watch out for lightning. Okay, where is he going to appear? Where is he going to appear? Where is, oh, where is he? I don't know where he is. Oh, okay, he's there. Yeah. Just be careful of when he does the lightning. Okay, okay, okay. And also be careful of him sucking you in, because if he sucks you in, it's an instant game over. But he only does that when he's low on health, but I would like to show you that attack, if at all possible. Eh. Oh no, oh no, lightning, lightning, lightning's bad. So, it seems like we can now, I guess, break through a shield or something, because he's uh, no longer protected, but then again, maybe his shield only worked against... The fiery powers on. Here's a sucking attack. Oh shoot! Oh, break these rocks with your star spin. It's not hard to get away from this, just as long as you run forward along the ground like that and spin. Whenever you see a rock coming towards, ow, towards you. Except I'm sort of failing here in my reaction time, but that's okay. We are golden here because we've got them. Yeah! Ha <laughs> ha! How's the floor taste? Oh yeah, I just referenced that line. <laughs> Attaboy! Thank you both! Woohoo! Uh-oh. Not over yet. <laughs> dun dun dun! You're mine now! Oh no! Bunston! If I can only inhale Bunston's power, I'll be unstoppable! No! Bunston, hold on! Never! Stop resisting! Oh! Oh. Well, that's one way of doing it. <laughs> Bunston! Uh oh. Oh! Oh! So much power! Oh! <laughs> oh! Bunston! He's in Mash Truth's belly! He's inside that thing! Bunston! about me! Just stop Mashtooth! Save my people! Starfy, please! Hurry! My kid, you'll... Yes! Hurt me! And you hurt your puny prince, too! Ooh. Not a good situation! Now, you two... You're next! Starf! Now what do we do? Nothing. What can you do? You face an invincible power. <laughs> Enough fun. We're done for, Starf. It's been great knowing ya.
paper crop crusher! It's you guys! No, oh, you brainless traitors! You're right! Mash Tooth is evil! Someone ha has to stop him! Hey, they don't get steamed peas. I mean, they don't got steamed peas for brains after all. Whoa! They spit out. You mean you spit out Bunsen? Yes! We've got nothing left. Get him! Do the spinny thing! <laughs> Do it! Get up, big bro! Starfy! Starfy! Is that all the gumption you got? Starfy! Starfy, come on! Go for it, Starf! Get up! No time for a nap! Sock him for me! What? Go, Starfy! You're a hero! <laughs> Alright, so... It seems like we have recovered. We are super powered with the power of friendship. We are flying through space for the second part of the final battle versus Mega Mash Tooth. I love this music. Attack! Mm. Oh, look out for lightning! Oh, I should look out for lightning that bounce into lightning. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll be okay. Everything will go just fine. No, you don't. Yeah, if you didn't notice, it takes three hits to knock away one bar of his health. But you can actually do this a little bit faster. After he takes a little bit of damage, he'll start throwing meteors at you from the background. And you can spin to deflect them, similar to the meteors that you could at the, um, the train when you were trying to deflect them to hit stuff and yeah. It's, but it's a lot easier to do here than it is on the train because they sort of like home in on him but it's still sort of kind of luck based in that regard but don't worry if you just keep deflecting the meteors or keep dodging the meteors you will be fine although it will take a little bit getting used to of this perspective here because you have to um, time yourself to spin you know whenever whenever you are and whenever a meteor is approaching, excuse me, there we go. And yes, you absolutely have to hit him on his head, by the way. <laughs> and where is he going? Where is he going? What's he doing? What's he doing? And nothing! <laughs> by the way, if uh, you don't get three hits in before he goes in the background, the counter for that particular spot on the bar will actually reset, and you'll have to do another three hits on him to try and... Ow! And to try and... Uh, uh, get his bar down. So yeah, you gotta hurry up when he's in the foreground if you want to get some damage off him. But the fastest way is by far getting meteors back at him. There we go! Alright, he's down. Okay, not really. Oh no! What's it gonna take? How much power does this guy have? Oh boy! Oh no! Shoop the whoop! <laughs> oh no, 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 don't, don't move it, Starfy! Oh, Meteor! Not good, not good. Get ready to mash the Y button! Ah, third phase of the battle! Button mashing time! No, oh, it's more powerful! I have to mash even harder than before! Mm, yeah! Turning his own power against him. Starfy finally defeated the vicious space pirate Mashtooth, returning the stolen power back to the Banarians. Woo! Yeah. 
Perfection! The Banarians were safe again! Guess that's all that really happened to them was their power was stolen. Once they get the power back, they recover instantly. They cheered for Bunston, proud of their young prince. Oh no, someone catch Starfy! Yes! Starfy returned, badly hurting from the battle with Mashtooth. Starfy! Everyone crowded around the hero, worrying. Get him a hyper potion! Oh, Starfy! Are you okay? Prince Bunston, who, who is this? <laughs> Bunston told them all the tale of his great adventure and how Starfy helped them. Wow, so this is the Prince Starfy? You've heard so much about him. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's cooking! Is his shell that hot? He's hurt. We have to help him fast. Mm hmm? Mm hmm? Oh? What is this? Healing powers! The Monarians use their powers to heal Starfy's injuries. They used Recover. Actually, maybe no, that would only work on themselves. Maybe they used Wish. And then they switched Pokemon. Oh, forget it. Ah. It's them! Haven't you done enough? What? Did, don't you... D Prince Bunston! Now's our chance! Didn't you see them help? It's payback time! Once and for all! Hey, guard guys. Hold that! These guys ain't exactly good eggs, but without their help, we would have been nothing but a snack in Mashtooth's belly. Can you find it in your hearts to forgive these knuckleheads? They know they messed up, so let's give them a chance to apologize. Yeah. That takes some real guts. We're sorry. We messed up. Now hold on. <laughs> All that trouble you caused. We can't let you off the hook that easy. Uh oh. Oh, please don't hurt us. I got it. You gotta beat Starfy in a game of rock, paper, scissors. If you can beat him, we'll cut you some slack. Well, they're pretty easy to beat. So I don't think Starfy is going to have really much of an issue beating them unless he throws the game. What do you think, Prince? Does that sound fair? <laughs> Make me proud! Don't go easy on him, Starf! Yeah, yeah! Okay, you're on! And they've recovered! On the count of three... One, two... Paper Rock! Of course he would choose paper. He's papes. One, two... Th of course he would choose rock. He's wrong! <laughs> and of course, scissors versus paper. Yeah, something was a little suspicious about that game, don't you think? Don't you think? Starfy, I'm on to you, kid. You lost on purpose. You can't fool me. <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> That's star for you. <laughs> Good thing it worked. <clears throat> Good thing it all worked out. Everything's all nice and quiet again, eh, Starf? <laughs> Once that moon recovers, all will be well. Yeah, almost as quiet as Puff Tom. Well, it's about that time. I say we get a we set a course for home. And here's the credits. I, of course, didn't make the game these awesome people did. I just made the walkthrough to help and entertain people. And we are about to see a little couple of cutscenes to see how things turned out on our way back. Oh, God. <laughs> 
Yeah, I don't... I guess they're backtracking all through the worlds to get back to their hometown. Well, they're in the sky now, so shouldn't they just be able to hop, skip, and a jump all the way? Well, I guess not. Well, they'll find some way back up there, I'm sure. Ah, Sogwood Forest. The place of emulator destruction. Well, no dot or no cash GBA destruction. <laughs> I'm glad I switched to Decimume. That water is still piping hot. I think they need to do something about that, otherwise that no one will want to go back to that tourist attraction. Oh no, oh no. Yes, push them away, Starfy. Before it's too late. And they're back home, yeah. <laughs> Just bowls over Starly. And the chase is on. Will she catch up with him? Who knows? Who knows? This could be a screensaver, by the way. <laughs> the way it's going here, and you know how it keeps repeating itself. At least repeating itself for now. Once the credits run down, this will change, and it looks like they're running down now. That's right! I did not make the game again, as I said. Just made the walkthrough to help and entertain people. I cannot stress that enough. A big thanks from Starfy. Come play again sometime. It says the end, but come on, you know there's some secret stages left to play. There's some other stuff and stuff to unlock and collect, and yeah, so we aren't done yet. P.S. A new stage has been unlocked. Stage 9, Puff Top. On top of that, Sea Tunes, Toys, Toys, and Big Boss Down are now in Moe's case. Starfy's adventure isn't over yet. Oh yeah, so this is definitely, definitely not the finale. In fact, I'm going to go back in the game and show you... Oops, Star Starfy's got glasses on. Well, sunglasses. Go back into ye old game and they poop me at Glug Glug Lagoon. Why? <laughs> Why did you put me all the way back here? Anyway, um, let's go into the the case first here. See, we've got a bunch of stuff here. Sea jams. This is what you probably would expect. The sound test. Yes. Put on your headphones and enjoy the awesome soundtrack of the legendary Starfy. I especially love this one, it's so calming. Oh yeah! Oh! Feeling those vibes. Feeling those vibes. Rock out! Mm, hit those drums! Okay, I'm done here. <laughs> so yeah, you can listen to that. Um, toys. This is a new thingy here. You can buy. Uh, you can buy stuff with your pearls. And yeah, I'll just insert five pearls here. And oh yeah, I need to touch screen it up. Mm, rotate that. Click. Actually, touch, and this is where you can find out the names of the game's enemies and whatnot. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, so this is another thing that you could go through and collect if you so desire, but this is pretty tedious, and to my knowledge, I don't think you get anything if you get all of these. So it's up to you if you want to uh, mega 100% this game. It, it's not, because you know, if you keep buying toys, you'll eventually get them all, but what I'm saying is that it's it's not something that you have any control over and it's not something that's hard to do at the same time so it's not like this it's not like this buying the toy thing is takes a lot of skill you just grind for pearls come back here buy some toys hope you get the ones you need etc etc and uh, fill out your toy collection here so yeah as, as you see they're also separated by um, levels here by uh, enemies and whatnot see the Hacha Springs, Chili Dip Cove, Sagwood Forest uh, the one we got here is the Glitzum Grotto the spine belly. Um, they go all the way over to a mysterious level of which we haven't seen just yet. Oh, ho, ho. But <laughs> okay, actually, that's actually not um, a level. It's it's something else. I'm just kind of um, keeping things mysterious here. But yeah, puff top, uh, planet Banera, SS Logwater. All these are all the enemies in the games that you can collect. 
uh, as toys. Um, big boss down. We gotta do this a little bit later. Yes, we literally have to do this uh, in order to unlock something. Um, new collection. Let's see what we have here. Bunsen is home. Right on the Cosmic Express to see fa some far off places with Moto. We kind of already did that. But as you see, we have um, um, Spook Star left here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to get in the, the power is actually in um, World 8, uh, Stage 8, excuse me, if I'm not mistaken. I mean, the last power upgrade. But uh, I'm going to show you here. See, we're at Stage 8. But if we go over to stage 9, look at that! We change over to Starly! Yeah! Remember I said that we might be playing as Starly later? Well... Back into off top? While well, Starfy and his companions trekked across the world... Well, actually, I didn't say might, I said we would be. Starly had some excitement of her own. Don't be cute! Hand over the brat! Because this time we brought friends. A whole lot. Huh? Mm, where's the little squirt who thinks he's tough? What? He's not here. This is our chance. Go wild, boys. Tear this place up. Find that kid. And so they did. Kind of. Until... Someone intervenes. You're the creep faces who made a mess of Puff Top. You're gonna pay, punks. This pink bowl's gonna haunt your bad dreams. You bad guys better get out of Puff Top if you know what's good for you. Where'd this little sass ball come from? He must be right related to that other star kid. Yeah, that reminds me. If we don't find that guy soon, the master tooth is gonna do something unpleasant to us. Yeah, I know, Ronk. Do you guys hear me? I said get out of here! Ha! You're pretty, you're pretty cute when you're getting mad. Kinda like a blushing lobster. That's it, they're all boys. And they're gone. Wait, did the stage start? I didn't want I just wanted to show the cutscene, not the stage. <laughs> well, I ran those guys off, but I still don't know what happened to Starfy. Yeah, bet those jokers know where he is. Better go after them. I can't do some, I can do some stuff my brother can't do. So check out the ability screen if you need to. And watch out for the legendary Starly. Yeah, the stage started. I didn't want to do that. Oh. Well. Back to the map we go. <laughs> yeah, that's stage 9-1. There's a whole load of stages here in Puff Top that we still got to do. Oh, yeah. And we play as Starly for them. So I'll cover them when I get back over here a little bit later. But for now, I'm going to end off the part here. Uh, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I go back through the levels and start collecting the stuff we missed. Well, I'll probably actually start with uh, uh, the secret levels in uh, World or Stage 8. But I'm rambling here. I'll, I'll figure it out by the time the next part starts. <laughs> Ta -da -da!